History was made at the Utah Democratic Party convention today. Fox 13 News reporter Sarah Murphy shows us how Utah Democrats chose not to nominate a Democratic candidate for U.S. Senate. Good morning, Utah Democrats. How are you? Cheers rang loud after Utah Democrats reached a decision at today's Utah Democratic Party convention. To nominate the uncontested Democratic candidate, Kale Weston, received 594 votes. Option two, to join Evan McMullen's independent coalition to beat Mike Lee instead of nominating a candidate for U.S. Senate, received 782 votes. For the first time in Utah history, Utah Democratic Party decided to not nominate a candidate for U.S. Senate. Instead, they voted to join candidate Evan McMullen's independent coalition. They say it's their best chance to beat Republican Senator Mike Lee. I feel good. I, you know, I, I know that, that most Utahns are ready to make a change in the Senate seat. And so I, I believe that I know that we have far more in common in this coalition than indifference. That uncontested Democratic candidate deserves our consideration. The decision wasn't an easy one. I think that democracy sometimes can be loud and uh, unpredictable, but I do think this process was really important for our party. I'm here, people are heading out, the convention just wrapped up, and you saw that when the results were announced, people were pretty excited. <laughs> Some delegates' concerns with McMullen. I've noticed that depending on the caucus, depending on who he's talked to, he's either the most liberal person I've ever met or he is the most right wing conservative person I've ever met. So where does he stand on the issues? I'm an independent. I'm not a Democrat, but I'm voting for Kale Weston. But others say it's a welcome change. We've just got to continue to build this coalition of Utahns. Sarah Murphy, Fox 13 News, Utah.